Hello everyone, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your daily tarot reading and it will be for Friday the 30th of April 2021 for all signs. So as always, it may or may not resonate, you decide what resonates. And remember, my readings can last a few days longer than when they're released. <coughs> So what do we have? What is the message people need to hear the most? Thank you, Angel Spirits Guides. And it will be for Friday, the 30th of April, 2021. Message people need to hear the most. Thank you. So we have you're ready. You're ready. Sometimes that comes up when we don't feel we are. Okay, so what do we have, please, Angel Spirits Guide? What is the message people need to hear the most for Friday the 30th of April 2021? So, okay, so we've got the five of coins. Justice, card of Libra, seven of coins, the world, the hermit, a lot of major arcana here, and the chariot, <laughs> card of Cancer, hermit is Virgo, Bottom of the deck is the Three of Swords. I'm going to clarify this Five of Coins. I'll use the other deck actually. Can we uh, clarify this Five of Coins please, Angel Spirits Guides? Let's clarify this Five of Coins, thank you. Clarify this five of coins, please, for all signs. Friday the 30th of April, 2021. I've got the three of pentacles. <clears throat> and let's clarify this seven of coins. Yeah, we have the ten of wands. So the message is you're ready. I'm going to get a card for that one actually. You're ready. Yeah. Celebration again, the three of cups. There is definitely an energy of um, You know what, before I start, I'm going to clarify this Three of Swords. Queen of Pentacles. There's a lot of healing energy going on here. <clears throat> because somebody has experienced... I mean, the, the Five of Pentacles can be loss, ins insufficiency, lack... Um, <clears throat> can be a card of also, I mean, the pentacles energy can be to do with our relationships. It's our conscious world. Um, so it can be relationships. It can be to do with money and career, our home, our property, um, our health. It feels something has challenged you with this five of coins. It can be to do with financial loss or changes in your finances for the detriment. And it's tested you. I mean, it feels like it's been a testing journey. I mean, the five of coins can be a card of begrudging, you know, begrudging somebody else. Now, it can also be a card of low self-value, self-worth, self-esteem, somebody making you feel like that. Uh, again, can you can feel a bit cast out, rejected. You sometimes see people in cold in the snow um, asking for help. You know, it, it feels like that kind of energy. So it, it feels that you've been through a period of... of 
being challenged in terms of value, uh, whether it's to do with monetary or how you've been treated. The three, of co the three of Coins or the Three of Pentacles is an energy of prioritising and focusing on how to bring the beginnings of success back into your life. Now, it can be about doing up a home, a property, uh, rebuilding your life, having gone through some challenging energy here. Um, it's very good in terms of money career as well. Teamwork, collaboration, partnerships um, can also be to do with, uh, you know, working in an, a new team, new job, that kind of energy. So it feels with this world card, which is generally a card of success, and it's a worldly success card, um, accomplishment. It feels the, the things that you've been focusing on, the energies that you've been putting in in a specific direction, it feels there is your... It's, it's this sense of digging yourself out of a hole and just being ready to step through to a new face of your life. It, it feels in this situation you've done everything that you can to manifest something new and it feels like there's some celebratory energy here. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, I'm really struggling with my end. Yeah, because I'm definitely getting this is a kind of good news, celebration, joy. There could be some legal decision going in your favour. I mean, there's a feeling of winning here. What is this five? Of, let's clarify this five of pentacles. Uh, temperance. Seven of cups. Just doing the things that you need to get back in balance and focusing on new hopes, new dreams, new wishes. And there's the beginnings of success here. This three of pentacles is, yeah, there's new hope. I mean, this is a card of reasons to be optimistic. Hope, hope, faith, you know, joy, you're on the right path now. It, it just feels for some of you that, you know, you're winning through what has been a difficult period. It could be to do with money, career, finances. But there is healing. I mean, you know, the Hermit is a card of healing. Um, finding answers from within, knowledge from within, introspection. Can be alone time. And again, this, this sun energy, which it feels as restoration, good news, celebration, joy, happiness, feel good energy coming through a difficult challenge. And the challenge seems to be um, the of getting balance back in your life. You know, justice is about restoring balance. Now, legal systems, government institutions, whatever this is, it feels that like there is balance being restored. It just feels like a winning. It feels like a winning energy. Because this Queen of Pentacles is generally somebody who is very successful. She also represents healing. But she's very good in terms of money, career, finances. I mean, she can also be about nurturing, healing, in whatever aspect this represents to you. But it's after the Three of Swords, which is... Somebody causing you emotional pain, third party situation, hurt, heartbreak, um, a truth that hurts deeply. It feels in this situation that somebody has been really tested. And I'm getting this energy of, of I mean, there's a kind of financially providing for yourself here. There could be some, you could have taken something to a tribunal or um, a legal gone through a legal process because it doesn't feel something was particularly fair when justice appears there is a need for the universe i mean actions have consequences and it feels that the universe is restoring some kind of balance good news feel good energy in your life the ten of wands is is the burden a burden path especially with the seven of pentacles when is it going to happen you know, I'm putting all this energy and effort into 
bringing material reward into my life. I mean, there's definitely this energy of someone has been really tested here. It's a card of good things come to those that wait, so keep on persevering. And um, this, this person's back is bent, but it's not broken. And the 10 signifies that something is coming to an end. The period of burden, you'll be able to put that down. So the message is just persevere. Because if you do persevere, you're going to win. I mean, there is definitely an energy of victory, success over what has been a difficult journey. And again, we've got this energy of celebration. I'm getting celebration all over this reading. Um, it just feels like for some of you, you might be getting a legal decision that you are waiting for that brings you success. Maybe some award or payout. It feels like some kind of legal payout. Let's clarify this chariot. What is the, the victory? And it ha it, the chariot is generally overcoming challenge. So what is the victory, please? What is this victory, please? Angels, spirits, guides. <clears throat> what is this victory? Yeah, the hermit. I mean, I feel that you're getting the answer that you want. The Page of Pentacles can be a message to do with something money-wise, uh, financial-wise. Uh, it, it feels like you're getting the answer that you want. I'm definitely getting this energy of money. It, it feels in this situation somebody has been through... Um, what has been a testing time, you know, that could be in terms of relationships, that could be in terms of business career, but it's almost kind of like a legal situation needed or legalities, a third party, a, a legal third party needed to step in to sort it out, to heal this situation because you couldn't do it on your own. And there's celebration at the end of this journey because it definitely feels for some of you, it's the answer that you want. You might be getting some legal payout here. Um, again, it could be an opportunity. The page can be a message to do with some opportunity or you're offered a job. Um, it, it feels somebody didn't act right. Uh, it could be an employer or uh, uh, somebody in a relationship. I mean, call it what you will. Somebody hasn't, it doesn't feel they've acted in the right way and you know karma but also the legal process which is all about being the, in the light of truth and a decision that will restore balance to a situation and it definitely feels in this situation for some of you you're getting the opportunity offered to you you're getting the payout offered to you it feels you're getting the answer that you want the message and it's been a testing journey my goodness the amount of saturnian energy in this reading but finally you're breaking free of it And you're liberating from it, which is beautiful because the justice is, is allowing you to liberate. Um, it's restoring balance and it's, it's allowing you to liberate and move on from it. Put it behind you and feel pretty good. It feels there's good news, a decision that goes in your favour. Oh gosh, again, three of swords. You know, this three of swords, whatever somebody, whatever somebody did, I don't think it was fair or it wasn't, it wasn't legally right anyway and I'm definitely getting you might be getting some kind of legal payout here it, it feels like you're getting the answer that you want this message an answer an offer uh, the offer that you want somebody making you an offer and it feels to do with some legal payout and that's what I keep on getting so I won't keep repeating myself you know um yeah And it's, it's kind of like, you know, you're ready. It feels you're ready to move on from this. And, you know, this is about the winter is over, the spring is here. I'm done with that situation. Finally, I can close that page. I can turn the page, sorry. I can close that book. Yeah, see, abundance. 
Prepare yourself for incoming abundance. Release any mental blocks you may have. In fairy land and human land, there's enough abundance for everyone. And we have precious time. The fairies of time want you to experience every moment fully and to make the most of your precious time. Be mindful not to waste others' time either. Uh, you might be getting some help or advice. Um, it's a card of team. It could well be a legal team, you know. Um, it feels you're getting the right help or advice to put you on the right path. Um, you know, it, it just feels in this energy. You've got help at hand here and it's the right kind of help that's going to bring in some kind of victory. Yeah, it, it just feels very beautiful. Powerful energy. So, um... I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you do, please do like, share and subscribe. I hope it's a wonderful day for you all and I will see you next time. Thank you.